studying for speed. I mean, say speed, yes, yeah, speed. This was something that I was always naturally good at. I was always really fast. I was always really fast at doing math problems. Is it bad? No. It can be though. It can be bad. There is a negative aspect to being fast and being able to do problems fast. That negative aspect is when you encounter a new topic or a new problem, you know, I tend to want to do it quickly. I'm impatient. I'm like, oh, oh, yeah, I can just do it. I should be able to just do it. And then when I get stuck, I'm like, oh, what do I do? So I have to force myself to slow down. So on a test, for test taking purposes, speed is your friend. So to study for speed, what you do is you make sure that you can actually redo all of the homework problems and all of the examples from the videos or the live lecture that you have quickly and correctly. Work on speed. And the reason speed is important is because you're taking a time test. Now, you might not agree with that. You might say, hey, you know, well, I should be able to have more time. If I had more time, I'd be okay. I'm a little bit slow. That is not the reality of life. That is just not how it works. You can't change that. I can't change that. But what you can do is change what you can. And that's yourself, right? Make yourself faster. I had this, I had this friend in, in grad school. The guy was brilliant. I mean, I just got goosebumps. So smart. And he was the opposite of me. He was what I like to call a careful thinker. He was able to think slowly and work out really difficult problems in just like beautiful ways. And whenever I work with him, I, I would learn from him because I realized that I was much faster than him. I would jump into, oh, we could do it like this. You know, just choose your epsilon to be this. And I would just blow through it. Whereas he had this like, well, let's just take it easy, man. And uh, you know, he would like, you know, slow down and go a little bit slower. He actually failed um, uh, a test in grad school. He got like a 40% on a test and he actually came back from that and got an A plus in the class because he was able to work on speed. So speed is important. It is a reality of test taking. So when you're, when you're ready for the test, go back and start working on speed. Start doing things fast.